Hello and welcome to a tour of System Surveyor. In the next few minutes, you'll get a good handle on why thousands of physical security and technology pros rely on System Surveyor to streamline site surveys and rapidly create system designs. You'll see how it helps our users engage with clients and stakeholders by visualizing system layouts to accelerate project decisions, automate a bill of materials, create branded reports, establish a digital as-built, and streamline implementation. System Surveyor is an easy-to-use site survey and system design software platform. As a platform, it is cloud-based and accessible from a web browser from anywhere. It also is available to use from a companion mobile tablet app on iPad or Android. This makes it easy to be mobile for a site survey to gather details, photos, and more for accurate designs and installations. System Surveyor makes it easy to gather all of the information, photos, and details for the design and management of a physical security system all in one place, and helps keep all stakeholders on the same page. System Surveyor is purpose-built for physical security, IoT, and other low-voltage technology systems. Through this video, you'll see how you can leverage pre-built icons ready for drag-and-drop design, photo capture and immediate attach, simple annotations and markup, automated bill of materials, powerful collaboration and customized reporting, and a digital as-built. Let's dive in. To begin this tour, I am logged into System Surveyor on the mobile tablet app. It's important to note that the app can be used independently of a network connection. First, you'll see the sites that you are working on. With each site, you are able to create a multitude of surveys, and within surveys are the elements, or device icons. As I open a site, we can create a survey by importing a floor plan or by using the Google Maps integration, which will auto-scale. In this case, I have a survey floor plan imported and will set the scale manually, which will be useful later. Oftentimes, a doorway is a great way to set the scale for the survey. Notice on the left-hand side that System Surveyor has a variety of pre-built system types. We'll show video surveillance as an example. In each system type, see that there are several pre-built icons ready for drag-and-drop design. Starting with a fixed camera, I place it into location to visualize the need and review the area of coverage. This helps with design and assists the decision maker to see the coverage and needs. With System Surveyor boundaries, you can put in a line where a wall or obstacle would exist. See how that impacts the area of coverage so that you can be accurate with your client or stakeholder to see precisely the field of view of a video surveillance camera or the coverage area of a Wi-Fi access point or sensor. This is also useful for technicians during the system installation phase. Next, I'll open the camera icon to take a photo of where the client would like the camera placed. This is an important feature that allows for an immediate association of the photo to the device and eliminates the hassle and time wasted trying to associate photos to a device later. Next, I can capture other relevant details that will be needed back at the office or to collaborate with my team. These same concepts hold true for access control, intrusion detection, IT, and more. In access control, see how you can create a container and nest various related devices inside that container to streamline your design. Now that you've captured these details on the site walk, you can get to a network connection and synchronize all of this information to the System Surveyor Cloud. Now that I am back at the office, I've accessed this site and survey through my web browser. You'll notice that the user interface is similar from the tablet app to the web. I'll review what I captured and refine the design. In this case, I'll select a Hanwha 2 megapixel indoor camera. Use the element profiles to bring in your favorite manufacturer or to build your own catalog. As you design, System Surveyor is automatically creating a bill of materials. Before finalizing the design, invite your team and vendor partners to view the survey using the collaboration features. 
there is no need to email the PDF of the floor plan. Rather, invite your team member or a guest user to log in and collaborate on the design. Now it's time to create a branded report for your sales proposal or documentation. We'll navigate first to a survey and click on the three dots in the upper right corner. From there, we'll click on reports to see the five reporting options. Two of the most popular reports are the survey layout and the bill of materials, which you can use to generate proposals. You'll have the opportunity to customize the reports on screen before you export them to Excel or a PDF. The layout report is a common, professional report to send to prospects or decision makers to convey your design work. Insert your logo along with the title block and legend to make it look sharp and official. The bill of materials report can be used to send to a manufacturer or subcontractor for a quote. The bill of materials may also be used to submit as a key part of a proposal or order. As a corporate or campus manager, it may be used to plan upcoming budget cycles or project expenses. Thank you for viewing this high-level tour of System Surveyor. Our user community values the mobility, ease of use, and collaborative nature of the platform. They tell us that they experience better accuracy of estimates and designs, hours of time savings, and that visual site design leads to higher value with improved sales, faster decision-making, and top-notch professionalism. Can System Surveyor help your business? Try it for free and see how easy it can be to optimize system design.